This is a reading of Brenda's blog titled Enough is Enough. Dear ones, perhaps you fear the world will never again experience sunshine or joy. Nothing is further from the truth because your diligent work of months, years, or even decades is finally showing itself, not as you probably expected, but in the most peaceful way possible. Instead of ignoring the outer-directed power grabs of various world leaders, as has been true in the past, you, en masse, are finding it impossible to deny such is happening. You are banding together regardless of race, religion, or creed. Even though it appears as if the bad guys have the upper hand, you fail to acknowledge the majority's strength. You regress to that outer-directed time when a few controlled the masses. A few no longer control the world because you and mass are discovering your common interests and power, exactly as you hoped it would happen. Now that it is happening, you are terrified you're not strong enough, smart enough, or heart-directed enough to push the outer-directed bullies to the side. Outer-directed bullies are no more. Even though they huff and puff and deliberately harm others, their outer-directed power is over. What once was is no more. Of course, there will be pain, fear, and worry about the possibilities of yet another angry outer-directed bully. Fear that will be for naught. For this is not yesterday, nor even this morning. Some are concerned that the world is focused on Europe instead of Africa, Asia, or other areas. Such is so for a reason. Many volunteered to leave Earth via this insurrection. They did so to negate worldwide religious and racial divisions. For once the world is united, as is now happening, it cannot return to isolation. Many of those wishing to open their hearts are doing so now. Some politicians are even changing their outer-directed bully stance. This action, this concept shift, is merely the opening volley. The world cohesiveness now becoming paramount is the heart opening many craved. Many hearts were closed tight before this last outer-directed aggression for various reasons, including political leanings. All of that has gone by the wayside as humans of opposing sides come together to stop something that once would have been acceptable. At the same time, those who once seemed opposed to heart openings are opening their hearts to discover their leaders are paper tigers. Leaders who once declared this was the only way, over and over, are now changing their conversations, not because they believe either side, but because they maintained their power through whatever was the politically correct opinion. As human beings open their hearts, they know who is heart-driven and who is outer-directed, power-driven. Those who are power-driven change their message according to the most popular concept of the day. Even though heart beings may change their tone, they do so from the heart, instead of outer-directed power needs. The truth will tell, even via your media screens. We of the universes predict many of your current political and financial leaders will fall. Not because they are not shifting with the times, but because they are merely doing so to maintain control. You will know instinctively who is functioning from their heart and who is pretending to do so to sustain outer-directed power. This is not about political leanings, but instead about heart openings. So it is that someone who used to claim outer-directed power in any way possible may now speak from the heart. 
and those who pretend to speak from the heart might expose themselves as outer directed. This is a new world with new thoughts and actions, a world you created and are creating. A new heart-based earth is now on full display. That is, this heart-based earth is as fully displayed as possible given that outer-directed actions are rapidly shifting to inner-directed love. There will be some world pain, not because it is necessary, but because you are all new to this earth love. The first step in negating fear is a world heart cohesiveness that lights any corner outer directed bullies can hide in. It is over. The jailers are opening the doors, not in fear, but because they no longer believe in their roles. At the same time, those of you in self imposed outer directed jails are walking through the open doors to the sunshine. There will be a few who wish to continue their jailer, jailed roles. That is their choice. But the world is now saying enough to the antics of outer-directed rulers and jailers. It is enough because of your ongoing need to swim upstream against outer-directed currents despite naysayers and your fears. Kudos for a job well done. Now sit back and send loving energies to those who are finding their heart. And all will resolve in ways you cannot yet imagine. So be it. Amen.